The third Vauxhall One Make Championship was the Vector Caterham Vauxhall Challenge, where truck racing champion Steve Parrish joined in the fun and discovered that One Make Racing really is close. Robert Nern, number seven, the son of Graham Nern, the Caterham founder, was dominant. At Brown's Hat, however, was the most spectacular accident of the season. Journalist Art Marcus was guesting in Steve Parrish's car. Right behind him was Nigel Smith. They pounded their way up across the start and finish line and then headed for Paddock Hill Bend. Smith tried the outside of Marcus and he wasn't going to give way. The two cars touched and then spun in the middle of the road, helped by Vernie Wood. Into the back of Marcus came Chris Metcalf. Three cars stationary in the middle of the road and as the drivers tried to make themselves free of the car, drama for Art Marcus. His Cajun burst into flames, Metcalf runs away, the marshals, brave as ever, are on the scene in seconds and Nigel Smith drags his colleague from the blazing car. A frightening accident, but thankfully none of the drivers were injured. From a different angle, you can see that Smith slides across the front of Marcus, Wood punts them into a spin and then with nowhere to go, Chris Metcalf arrives on the scene. A stunned Marcus tries to recover while Smith and Metcalf undo their belts, ready to run to safety. And then the flames come from the back of Art Marcus's Caterham. Smith and Metcalf run to a place of safety, while the marshals are already coming across the road with fire extinguishers, despite the cars still coming past. At the restart, David Walton, the racing instructor, scored his only win of the year in a championship that was clinched by the dominant Robert Nern.